one testing one two three Recording testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three. Once the Sebo Fish and Philly, Shabbat evening. As usual, we sitting here. Uh, there seems to be a dearth of information during the Shabbat. You don't get a chance to hear too much. But uh, I read a verse earlier. I was trying to explain what's happening here with it with us. You wake up one day and everything seems, uh, you know they now on vaccinating your kids. Everything seems to be everything, but everything is not everything. And uh, one of the, one of the, one of the uh, papers I read, one of the guys I read, he was saying is uh, the world is under an evil spell. And that phrase really captured what I was trying to put out to someone earlier. I used a little phony analogy of a little girl on one of these islands who had just that week learned in school that when the, when the ocean pulls out, when the ocean is drawn off the beach, it means that uh, a tidal wave is getting ready to come on the beach. So she was out there. You know, a lot of tourists and stuff, and the water started to recede. And the people, uh, you know, the tourists, uh, they didn't know what was going on. They started walking towards the ocean to see the different things that were uncovered. You know, these rocks and different clams and shells and stuff they could see as the water pulls away. By The water pulls away by like maybe, uh, you know, almost half a mile or something. So they were looking at all this stuff, you know, going towards it. And sure enough, uh, within minutes, uh, they could look up and see uh, this big wall of water coming. And it killed, it killed quite a few of them. The little girl was running the other way, just from the beginning. As soon as she noticed that the water was going out, she was running the opposite direction, which she had learned in school. Being an island child, that that, that means something's going to happen. On, the water's going to come on, even though you see it leaving now. And... Uh, they just looked at it like she was sleeping or something. She was running, from the, running up the beach. Well, I was trying to say that to say, to explain how, uh, what's going on here with, uh, particularly when I got up today, it doesn't happen every day, but it happened today. It's though everything is everything, everything is going on. And, uh, but the guy put on an expression, uh, which fits to, which happens most, the entire world is on, in a, within an evil spell. And the, the Most High, he speaks on it. He terms it as, uh, basically that's what he said. He said he's going to put them under a deep uh, illusion. Delusion. And the delusion is like, uh, Jacob trouble's not upon us. But I'm pretty sure it is. It hasn't manifested itself quite like, you know, uh, yeah. Even though they're jabbing the kids, which is enough for me. I mean, even jabbing adults is one thing. But they got a lady up in New York. Well, man, man, make it mandatory that you jab, jab your kids. And uh, you know, it's another generation. But when we were kids, something like that was mandatory also. You couldn't go to school. As far as I remember, without letting a jab. I'm going to test this out. Shabbat Shalom, Shibu Fishing Philly. Talk to y'all later.